We picked like the perfect day for it. The sky is just blue. There's just a few clouds. It's still warm. Just perfect. Hello everyone, we are here at Spiral Jetty in Utah. It is a sculpture that was originally built on the north part of the Great Salt Lake, but, oh, there's Kimmy. So you can see today it is kind of not on the lake anymore. The lake's just dried up so much. Uh, but we're here to get some sunset photos and check it out because we've never been here before. The sun's gonna set right over here over the lake. And we're also going to check out what's up there and go ahead and hike up, set up the tripod to get some nice sunset shots. I'm also going to fly the drone, so just going to be a short video today of our adventure, trying something new. Uh, I'm going to read what this says to so you guys can learn a little bit more about what Spiral Jetty is. It says, Spiral Jetty is an earthwork sculpture constructed in April 1970 that is considered to be the central work of American sculptor Robert Smithson, built on the northwestern, northeastern shore of the Great Salt Lake. Entirely of mud, salt crystals, basalt, rocks, and water, Spiral Jetty forms a 1,500 foot long, 15 foot wide, counterclockwise, coil jutting from the shore of the lake. All right, part of the way up the hill, you can start to see Salt Lake a little better and the jetty. Just flew the drone, uh, flew it over the jetty and then just a little over the lake. I didn't want to fly it too far, even though it's perfect visibility. Uh, maybe, maybe I will as the sun continues to set a little. Um, but we just found this perfect spot up here to just kind of wait for the sunset. Uh, you've still got the spiral jetty down there and the whole Great Salt Lake, sun setting right there. You can keep going up where people are over here, but we decided this was just a nice flat area away from everyone where we could fly the drone and do that kind of stuff. I'm going to set up the tripod now and get ready for sunset photos and video. And then we're going to head down if I don't fly the drone again um, as the sun sets more, but we could do that from down there too. So.
Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. I'm sorry that I didn't film an outro on location. Uh, we just got really busy with filming and taking pictures and flying the drone and we left when it got pretty dark. Um, we had a lot of fun. So I know this video wasn't very long. Uh, just wanted to kind of capture what it looked like. I focused more on photography than I did video uh, for this trip. But if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel if you're interested in the stuff that I make. Going to be a ton of adventure videos on the way. I'm going to be hiking a lot more, kayaking, stuff like that. So the summer is going to be filled with adventure videos and I can't wait to share them all with you.